15 days, this is all they have been thinking about, getting to Dakar. The survivors of the Africa Eco Race have finally realized their dream, to start the ultimate stage, the most prestigious, along the Atlantic Ocean, to cross the line on the shores of the mythical Lac Rose, a beautiful close to a magical two weeks of racing, pain, suffering, and fun. On the program this Sunday, the last 22 kilometers of selective sector between Nikob and Lac Rose. At the start in Monaco 15 days ago, there were nearly 60. This Sunday, most have stayed the course and are at the start line on the shores of Lac Rose, all behind Stefan Svitko. The Slovak won five stages. In Mauritania, he took advantage of Dorini's error, seizing the chance to take the lead of the race and never let go. Rally Dakar is very, very dangerous. Uh, here is a uh, uh, very, very stage. Mauritania is a beautiful uh, country. Uh, a lot of, uh, lot of uh, sand, uh, sand, do, uh, sand dunes and sand peas. Very beautiful for me. Overall, Svitko wins the 14th edition of the Africa Eco Race, coming in 1 hour 38 ahead of Girini. Javier Flick, the first rider of the Motel Extreme Riders, is third ahead of Alvasta Taros and Wallace. The Motel Extreme Riders have crowned a new champion. 27-year-old Frenchman Javier Flick, leader of the category since the first special, is amazed to win here at Lac Rose. It was funny this morning when they started the race. There was a certain adrenaline. It's heartwarming. That's it, we're at the finish. The race is over and we're in a historic site of rally raid, so it's a pleasure. And there, at the finish, it's really something else. trucks, the aims and motivations were identical to the other categories. But Senegal is an El Dorado. One must get there at all costs. And Thomas Tomczyk arrived alone for a historic first. It's the first time alone, but I am uh, uh, by, by race more satisfied. This is freedom, racing freedom. And I like it. I love it because uh, uh, I can do what I want and no stress, only on, on myself. I'm, I'm maximum satisfied. They set themselves the same goal, get to Dakar. In their SSV, a highly maneuverable vehicle that is great fun in the sand dunes, Jean Daga Hayek and Patrick Antonioli came top of the pack this year. Today, we forget everything. Seriously, it was difficult and trying. We couldn't wait for it to end, but now, today, we forget everything. We are happy. And we're going to enjoy, we're going to celebrate this victory. And then in the car, the most regular of all was Philippe Goslin. He won five special stages, two in Morocco, two in Mauritania, and one in Senegal. He had no major mechanical problems, and he managed to sand well, climbing to the top of the podium as a result. Well, it's something I hadn't imagined. Winning a stage or two from time to time in a rally, it would have suited me. But to win a rally completely, there, I discover. I discover the interviews, all that, and frankly, it makes me happy. In the general, victory for the 204, ahead of the SSV of Jean Daga Hayek, Meyer is third, Tomczyk and his Tatra are fifth. That's it for this edition of the race. We'll see you in five months' time for the 15th edition in March.